What is up everybody, this is your host Superside and welcome back to another short and brief video of Heyday and in this video I am going to be showing you my favorite ad in Heyday. Now it's not often that I say, hey look we've got an awesome ad, like I know it's like definitely not common at all because ads are normally rubbish and I don't enjoy particularly watching them, but this ad in particular happens to be a really really awesome ad. So if we come here and we press the tick right here, then up it brings this thing right here which is this new ad, this new type of game called Empires and Puzzles. So what if you do, you swap that along, and you can do this, and it's like, it's a little bit like other games that I have played, like, what's the other one, Candy Crush, that's the one, but you swipe these, and I actually enjoy playing this, like, it's actually, like, a fun ad. Like, it was as of recently that they made it, that you could, that the ads were actually interactive, but this one here, particularly, is super interactive, like, there's a few of them, and you can do a, a few moves, probably this year, definitely no earlier than 2018, they certainly weren't active, but now they are, and so I actually literally enjoy playing them, and I'll spend longer than the 30 seconds or 15 seconds or whatever designated to it, and there we go, I don't want to lose this if possible, swap that there, and then swap that, and there we go, we just got a victory on an ad, so yes, that there is something that I find really interesting, like, this ad is actually really, really fun to play, and then if we press X there, if we're lucky enough, I'd actually hope for another ad. But unfortunately, thank you, you have watched all the available ad, all, all available trailers for today. Which is a shame, because I was, I was genuinely, oh, five diamonds, yeah, the five diamonds. We will accept that happily and go along here, right, and go along. Oh, yes, TNT barrel, let's get some of that. Oh, and oh, and the rest of it, and the rest of it. Oh, that was, oh, and then tap that, get those revives. Those, oh, those revives, get those ones over there, that one there, sweet, here we go, okay, that was good, there, oh, there we go, yeah, the platinum bars, okay, this farm, I am liking it right here, this is a good farm, this is a beautiful farm right here, which, oh, look at these pickaxes and everything, left, right, and center, so yeah, I thought I would show you that ad, because it's not normally that I actually enjoy the ads, but now the ads have actually become so interactive, it's like, you're playing a little mini game, it's like, give me more of those ads, what they should do is they should have it that it just saves it, so it's actually letting you play 30 seconds of that game every time. And so then it, it saves your scores. So as you play the game more and more and more and more, it just shows you over time. And so then you get really used to it, and you'd start getting really, really used to it. And then it would say, like, hey, come buy this ad, come try out this game, because this is where you've got the high scores, and we'll transfer the high score. I don't know if they could do all that, but it would certainly be fun. Or if just all that, I just had a great idea. If all the heyday players could compete on the leaderboard in that 30-second thing, and you probably have people playing for way longer than 30 seconds if they made it like a, a five minute challenge or something along those lines and then it compared all the heyday people that would be so funny that is a good idea for those companies that would be so smart because technically it only lasts like 30 seconds normally is the ad time sometimes 15 seconds but it's not until you exit it that it stops but technically it could have the whole game inbuilt into that 30 seconds until it doesn't exit until you press x so it's effectively like opening another app that is, I reckon that would actually be quite cool. That would be quite cool. And so then, you know, me and Ricky and Nighthawk and my heyday and all the other heyday YouTubers would all be competing. It would be entertaining ads. And seeing all you, all my subscribers and viewers, like, on there as well, that would be really, really cool if they did that. Right, so as you can see, right now I have Ernest, which is currently, he had, a, I just sold a whole heap of them. But, oh, oh, this is refreshed again. Let's go for some bargains. Oh, diamond rings, we can grab some of them. Right, oh, tap. Yes, there we go. I got that. I, I, yeah, I'm, over time, I reckon I have got faster at tapping things. I used to be really, like, well, I used to be much slower than I am now. Now I'm fairly fast at being able to tap things, and if we come in here, right in there, someone sold all that. So there we go. Yeah, and sometimes I'm real quick at putting stuff up as well. Not always. Sometimes I'm just, like, really slow, but other times, other times, like, now I'm just sort of going, like, I'm going fast enough, but I'm not super fast like I sometimes can be. In fact, we'll put on some, some of these right here. Okay, so that one is now up, and there we go. We'll put on some more strawberries right there. Come over here. These can go into strawberries as well like so, there we go, so we got them, and uh, right, so uh, how's our barn looking, our barn, oh yes, just eight more bolts, and we will have it, and okay, so I'm, I'm looking forward to getting that barn upgrade, that will be really, really awesome, 
So in the meantime, we will go along here to the town, which I don't often as much as I should, considering I've now unlocked the whole town, which I think is really, really, really awesome. It took me a while to unlock it, but now I've unlocked it, it's like, yes! Oh, and a purple voucher. Yes, I like purple vouchers. I like all vouchers, but... Purple and gold are like, yeah, yeah, the other ones are pretty good, but not as good as these ones. I've always thought they're so overpriced. I never, it would never give you like 80 diamonds for one voucher. It's like, what? It's just so, so expensive. It's just crazy. Like, seriously, that is just insane. Like, you can get like the best decorations for that. Like, honestly, I uh, just, yeah, it's, it's just crazy. Like, yeah, 90 diamonds. See, similar price for some decent decorations. So yeah, there's 90, I guess 90, and it's like 80, yeah, all these ones for 10, you could get 8 of them instead of 1 gold voucher, but it isn't, oh, we got the sheep thing, we got the sheep thing, that is kind of cool, in fact, I've never actually put decorations here, but why not, why not, now, now, now that we got them, is there one that shows the stored, oh, we've got, we've got those stored, uh, right, but it's not Halloween at the moment, right, where if we cut, wait, where, where did the other ones go, the, oh, this one here maybe, oh, right, so we got some fences, I, I didn't realise that you could put decorations in the town, was that a feature of the latest update? It may well have been. Okay, now, now I'm just... All those stupid instruments right there. And now I can't find what, what I was looking for. Oh, and we've got... Oh, we can buy another one of those trees. Right, okay. And uh, yeah, I recently found out that you could move it. Like, I may have known right near the start, but I'd totally forgotten. Same with this thing here. I was... I used to... Well, when I did the video yesterday, I was like... What? You can move this? That's so cool! I, yeah, when I found out this here is movable. What? And what? Is there an upgrade? There's an upgrade. I think I, I, I sort of, I semi remember things, but I semi forget things. So like, I like, when I see it, I'm like, what, you can upgrade this? But then I like think back and I'm like, oh, I think I very vaguely remember that you could upgrade them. But like, I still get nevertheless excited that it's like, it's the equivalent of discovering it for the first time because I've forgotten. And so although it's like very, very vaguely there, I'm just like, oh, whoa, you can upgrade it. Oh, whoa, you can move it. Oh, whoa, you can place decorations. Like I know, I know on the main farm, of course, but I didn't realize you could do it in the town. So yeah, hence there may be references in my older videos of me mentioning oh that like and and saying and like literally moving this around and then and then you'll be like what the other video you knew you knew about it well yeah I've forgotten there's a lot of cool things in heyday there are a lot of cool things in heyday right there we go we'll just tap along here we I I wanted the where's the other thing that we got I don't know that there was the sheep I don't know where where oh there we go the 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 tire agility tire that's a cool name for it and the rocking unicorn we'll put that there. I had it keeps going to back up to the top it's like no just stay where we were just stay bear with me there we go so that right there we go okay that that's kind of cool we've got some three decorations out right there interesting okay so now we will go to the personal wait we'll just check this how many have we got forty two okay so we'll get rid of all the triple ones first although they are purple uh, like uh pink like purple like purple pink the names. But I, I don't really particularly need them because like three is so hard because if just one of the orders of the three Like they don't you can't do it's then like it just messes it all up So I never like to do the threes at all the twos are fine, but the ones are the best if possible And also if you can get a two It's better to have it with the, the poor next to it as well Because that means that then they'll visit the sanctuary afterwards and leave a gift and I have collected up a few dip, a few wee gifts over time right and then we'll come in here Can we help you out in any of these orders? No, not there. There's a hot chocolate one I can do right where's the hot chocolate one not that one there not that one, that one there, yes, we can do that one, and there we go, there's the hot chalky one right there, and tap, 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 and over here, tap, 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 oh, there, another hot chalky one, okay, we, we got a few right there, this one in here, this one in here, okay, sweet, and so now, let's, in fact, we, we should be able to upgrade them eventually, can we upgrade it, can we upgrade, oh, no, but we don't, wait, so that one's max, that's good, it was, so that one's max, and the bed and breakfast is also maxed, this town hall is also maxed, and this here, right, not that, this one here is also maxed. Okay, that's sweet. And so now, since those, the first three, the first three require actual building materials, grocery store, cinema, and diner. And then the final four, like, I use non, like, stuff. They just use, like, non-building materials, because I don't like using building materials like Sims and Lems, uh, no, Sims and... And bems if possible, which are the barn tools and that. So can we upgrade the spa? So that's oh the spa's maxed as well. I'm doing quite well actually. If I don't say so myself. I didn't realize how much 
Right, so this one must be like the final one to do. Right, so we go there. Oh, nine. Yeah, that's reasonable. Oh, and we can do an upgrade. Yeah, the upgrade. I love it when I can do an upgrade. Yes. Okay, let's just do it. Let's just go ahead. Okay, and three, two, one, and boom town. There we go. We have officially upgraded that. And so we got a couple more to go before we're at level 13. And so, yeah, I I'm happy with that. That's good progress. That is really good progress. And so let's just see which ones we need. So we'll get some from the spa, diner grocery store okay and then a gift shop so those ones there so just uh forget about the cinema and the beach calf okay because i just remember which ones to get so then i i get the ones i need and we'll just tap that and oh yes we got an axe so then we come here so it's the cinema and the so it's the cinema and the beach calf that we don't want that's all good we'll come over here this one here there we go so not that one we'll go that one that one and that one and that one sweet get those in there come over here right what do we got here and it's that's uh not that one no thank you we'll go past that and then we'll come up here so i'm just getting the ones that i actually need them for that and that perfect and then we'll go home and then it will deliver all the single requirement vi like visitors and then oh yeah and there's the there's the probabilities that i missed in the probabilities video a while back because it, it wasn't right but yeah as you can see a massive chance of getting an axe like that's huge that's like almost one in five times you'll get an axe and then you've got all these other things a lot of a lot of vouchers well interesting because that just says vouchers it doesn't say green vouchers whereas you know like like because i thought they would separate out the chances of getting each colored voucher so i think yeah and then you've got poor tom way down there at 0 0.19 which isn't much but diamonds about one percent so one in a hundred times you get diamonds which is good but it, it's still not often and so okay so we'll exit that right there and then we have all these and so we'll go ahead and we'll do that and so tap that there tap that there tap that and get them going into the right location and then we'll be able to serve them, and then we'll be able to get some tools, and they'll get the food, or groceries, or jewelry, or whatever they're looking for, and then we'll be able to get those extra bonus building materials, and then we'll be able to upgrade our barn and our silo, which will be awesome, and so tap that, tap that, there we go, and then we come over here, we can't do that yet, we can do that one, can't do that one, right, what about in here, let's just check out this one, yes, we can help you with that, we can help you with that, not that one yet, this one, perfect, Yes, we'll use them because we got some of them growing. That one, perfect, perfect, perfect. Okay, that, that is really good. That is really good. That is awesome. That's epic. I am very happy with that. That is a good day's work for the town. That is a very good day's work. And also, yes, that ad was my favorite ad. So I would love to let... The, to hear what you guys think of your favorite ad. Have you seen that ad? Are the ads different based on the country? Like, I do recall... They did change once, like I saw one localized one for a, a an, an insurance, which they only offered in New Zealand, I think. And so, yeah, they, they are, but I'm not sure, no, that might have been Heyday, that must have been another game. But yes, I would love to know, do you get the same ads? Do you, have you got that one? And do you enjoy it? Have you played it? And so, yes, let me know in the comments about that. Please like the video if you enjoyed it. Please subscribe if you're new to my channel. And for those of you already subscribed, thank you so much. I appreciate each and every one of you. This has been your host, Supersight, and remember to make coins faster than honeybees make honey.